hello guys welcome back to my channel i'm horace and you're watching possible now so guys today i'm going to guide you about uh if you have a low end pc and you face lag freezing and strutting kind of an issue in fortnite chapter 6 also uh, you face uh fps drop kind of problem so then this video is for you just watch the video till the end and if you're new in this channel kindly like this video share to your friends and subscribe to the channel for more content and without any waste of time let's start the video so guys before starting the video let me introduce you the best tool for fixing ping and input lay issues in your games give up store it's simple and easy to use you can try it out with a three days free trial all you need to do is add your game click once and you're good to go check out the link in the description to get started so guys first of all uh, the first method is you need to update your graphics driver so for this you need to open your nvidia geforce experience uh, for nvidia user and go to the drivers tab here and in the drivers tab guys you can see the option check for updates simply click on it and it will automatically check for latest drivers uh, in your pc and uh, for amd user guys you can do the same step in your radon software and the next thing guys is you need to uh, go to the epic games launcher and go to the library and find fortnite click on three dots and click on options and now here we need to disable uh, or unmark some settings like if you don't play save the world then unmark the option high resolution texture you need to turn it off um, if you play on your low end pc or you face like lag freezing or fps drop kind of an issue and pre-download streamed acid uh, for my recommendation you need to uh, turn this off and uh, if the direct x12 option uh, is available here then you need to turn it off also because we need to run our game on dx11 or performance mode so that's it after that click close and the next thing guys is you need to delete some junk or bad files in your system so for this you need to press window key plus r and open the run dialog box and in here guys you need to uh, uh, type the first command like a uh, percentage temp t e m p and again percentage here's the first command guys and click on ok Control a select all and delete all of these bad files in your pc don't worry uh, these all are junk files so uh, that's not uh, like uh, necessary or important files so it will take some time just wait for it and uh, after a few minutes guys close this and now we use the second command again press win window key plus r and uh, again we type here uh, the second command prefetch p r e f e t c h it's a second command click ok click to continue Control a select all and delete all of these bad files now mark the option and skip the step now guys one last command we use here uh, is simple temp t e m p click ok Control a and delete this file now guys in the end you need to del delete all these files in the recycle bin also that's it now guys the next step you need to um, uh, open your task manager and uh, we need to free our cpu space because uh, fortnite is a cpu uh, game so that's why we need to free our cpu space open your task manager and uh, in here you need to go to the uh, performance tab and now you see your uh, like a cpu memory and uh, what you're gonna do is in the processes tab you s you find the some like software or application that takes your cpu memory my cpu memory is already free but in case uh, like while uh, play your game or uh, before launching your game you can see this uh, cpu memory if any of the program or file uh, that takes your cpu memory just simply right click on it and end task that program and uh, after that guys simply free your cpu space and close the tab now guys the next thing is we need to 
open our epic games launcher and uh, go to library find fortnite click on three dots and this time we need to go to the manage option and in here guys you need to uh, see the option in the launch option we can use the command you can uh, see on the screen like dash d3d11 or dash feature level command uh, both use command one by one and check which works best for you now close the tab and uh, the next thing guys is you is we need to um, disable or close the background applications so for this we need to uh, research here settings the research bar we need to research settings and uh, in here we need to go to the privacy section and in general turn off all of these four settings and down below uh, go to the background apps and turn off all the background apps running in the background and after that get back and now move to the gaming section and uh, turn off game bar and uh, turn on your game mode section and also turn off the capture settings and uh, after that guys now uh, you could to go you're ready to launch your game and now you can play your game without any lag or freezing or strutting kind of an issue and uh, this and if this video helped guys kindly like this video share to your friends and subscribe the channel for more content and we will meet in the next one until then peace out